<laughs> did you finish burying the goose or uh, not? I guess whatever makes you <laughs> okay, laugh. So I don't see what's so funny about killing the a goose and him <laughs> trying to really? cover up his murder, but alright. <laughs> okay, I'm back. But life is strange, true colors. And um, uh, I guess we're gonna solve this mystery. But okay, since we're past the first episode now, and I won't be giving any spoilers, hopefully. If you haven't seen the first episode, Life is Strange, then don't listen. But like, why is it that Life is Strange has this weird first chapter thing where someone has to die? Like, someone has always died in the first chapter. And it's like, I don't remember exactly when Chloe died. Like, technically Chloe died in the first chapter. Even though she didn't stay there, she still died. Then Sean's father died at the end of the episode. Now Gabe died at the end of the episode. Still real upset about that, but anyway, let's get started. <laughs> This is messed up, bro. I'm not big on speeches. Uh, I've always believed that the role of the bartender <sighs> is to shut up and listen. And by that measure, Gabe was the worst bartender I've ever known. This is so sad. I never issued a speeding ticket to someone on a bicycle before <laughs> till he came along. He cared so much about my admissions essay. Even though he probably couldn't spell admissions <laughs> or essay. <laughs> he booked my band to play the lantern all the way from Seattle pretty much right where I'm standing. I can recall 14 specific instances where Gabe said something that made me laugh. <laughs> the first was two years ago. So, long story short, instead of a ticket, I ended up buying him a beer. Gabe stood like three feet away, grinning like a doofus at us. I'm sure there were more people. This got me teary eyed, like legit. But I only remember him. And then he said, I know, that's why the K is silent. <laughs> <laughs> Then the fifth time... He cared about everyone. He was the kind of guy you wanted to be around. He was a world-class bullshitter. He was my best friend. to say about Gabe is he came into this bar as a stranger but he left it as family <clears throat> guess that's that then what happened to Gabe was a senseless tragic accident was it? and i just wish it wasn't an accident <laughs> son now is not the time gabe called the mine yeah, he did oh i gave him my sat phone to be sure he could get through what you got for they for? fucked up they're just trying to make him look suspicious there ain't no way he did that and now now gabe's dead that was my shift 
Oh. If anyone had called, it would have Wait gone through me. Nobody what? called. What? Huh? You're lying. <laughs> In oh. front of Gabe's own fucking sister. Alex heard the whole thing. He... Yeah. He's right. I was there when Gabe made Wait, the I don't call. think I was, actually. I'd like to hear what you have to say about that, Mac. Oh. I'm not saying anything. Oh, gosh. Just, I didn't get a call. Try your own conclusions. Then who answered the phone? All right, folks. This is an ongoing investigation. How about that we review the sequence of events? Oh. Hmm? Oh, son. When I saw you at the record store, Brian you seemed pretty eager to find Gabe. Remember why? Hmm? Another fight with Riley, maybe? No, I don't have to take this. He didn't saying, do anything. pretty wild that you come stumbling out of Gabe's apartment with your face all fucked up. Oh, right. And just a couple hours later, come you just on, so happened his funeral? to miss the call that would have saved his life. Look, I told you there was no call to miss. Hey, maybe the call got dropped. Oh shit, I mean, it's not like, it's not like uh, Gabe uh, was uh, Mr. No, no, no. all no, the time. No, no. Uh -oh. Watch your mouth, Mac. Ryan, that's enough. Now, I'm just as eager as you to understand all this, son, but there was a time... Bullshit, oh. Dad. This little weasel's calling Gabe a liar at his own fucking wake. No, I am just telling you. Mac, I swear, if you say there was no call one more fucking time... Uh -oh. Stop it! Stop it now! Oh. This is not the time it or really place. Isn't. We're all here for Gabe. Okay, Ryan. Sure, I'm. Just I'm shush, sorry. Shush, just shush. It's not. I'm just trying. Oh gosh. <laughs> Awkward. My gosh. I'm not the one who killed him. Oh. Uh. Aren't you? Oh, no. What the Oh, fuck did you God. Just say? Ryan, back off. Oh, hell. I'm just saying. I thought I heard that you Mac, were the one. You shut the hell up. No. No, go ahead. You got something to God say, Mac? Dang, Let's bro, fucking please. Come on, guys. Don't make me interrupt. All right. Fine. As long as we're tossing around accusations, way I hear it, you're the guy who cut the rope. He look, he was already messed up. The, like, there was no way they could save him, and I was just gonna was just gonna die with him. Why not you? That's it. Wait's over. Everyone out. Alex? Hey. Fuck those guys. <laughs> yeah. Are you okay? <laughs> no. <laughs> Hell no. God, no. I'm a fucking wreck. It's not your job to keep it together. Thanks. Do you... Um... It's messy, but... Do you want to come in? Sure. You play guitar? Uh, used to? Yeah, well, sorta. I used to. Cool. <laughs> okay. Um.
Gabe would try to pop wheelies outside the record store to make me laugh. Never worked. Till he wiped out. That was hilarious. Gabe really wanted to do the LARP for Ethan. But by the end of it, he was more jazzed about it than anybody. Wish I could have seen it. Yeah. <laughs> we took this a year ago. We... No way. I can't. What? We actually kept it. Aww. This is making me feel Whatever that her. bottle made her think of, it really messed her up. I wonder if I could help her the same way I helped Ethan. Oh, really? I need to feel her sadness to figure out how to help her. Foosball champion? Why would that make her so sad? what's really going on with Steph. Wow, okay. What are they called again? Don't shit on my yard! They're amazing! Their guitarist has one arm. Badass. That's <laughs> one arm. <laughs> Dude, give it up. I already booked a bus ticket. Wait, wait, hear me out. One more game. If I win, you have to stay. If you win, I'll cover the ticket. You just lost 50 bucks. Why was she about to leave? Why can I click on it again? Damn it, fucking overpowered blue meteor. Aww, <laughs> is your controller broken too? We're playing until I win. <laughs> then I'll be crashing here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting your new foosball champion, Gabe Chen. Oh, you're the worst. Can't believe I have to stay in this stupid town. I think we both know you could have beat me if you really wanted to. So you're welcome. Bullshit. <laughs> is there anything else? I'm really bad at moving uh, the camera and walking at the same time. So. Here's to your new job at the station. Oh, didn't I tell you? I'm not taking it. I move to Denver next week. You what? I think I know enough to help her now. Okay. Uh, I 
I guess. Oh. Still can't believe he's gone. Yeah. He's the whole reason I'm still... I'm sorry, Alex. Don't mind me. Uh... Looks well. How about a quick match? Did Gabe tell you we played? I had a hunch. I just had a hunch. Yeah? Well, you're right. I don't really think it's a great time. Okay, I didn't think she was gonna ask her to play. Fine. Oh, okay. It was a challenge. I, okay, I feel like I actually need to play this. First to five points? If you say so. Um. <laughs> what the heck? Wait a minute now. So, how often did you and Gabe play? It was one of our favorite games. You um, must be pretty good then. I'm going to suck mm -hmm. at this. What the heck? Why are they like this? Okay. Elsie. Elsie. You were in a band, right? Yeah. What'd you play? Drums. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. How, uh, how long did you play with them? <laughs> Too long. Wait a minute. Gotcha. Oh shoot, wait. I kicked it the wrong way. Wait, or did I? No, I did it. <laughs> I'm so lost. No! Oh! Oh, I can move this out the side? Oh no, this is a hot mess. Gosh dang it. I'm really just moving. Oh, okay! <laughs> Five points! That's game! Yep. Big shocker. <laughs> oh, hey, at least you played your best. I mean, that obviously wasn't my best. No, I get it. I mean, this is a tough game. It requires skill, timing, and the will to be a champion. Oh, is that how it is? <sighs> okay, okay. Joking aside, playing this stupid game with you is exactly what I need right now. Did I help a little bit? Bro? You're on. I'm on again? Lord Jesus. <laughs> Just wait a minute, bruh. I'm actually trying this time. So you better Oh, focus. shoot. Bruh. Okay. Good. Wouldn't want you to get distracted. I'm already then. distracted because I Sorry, cannot play. I'm so lost. Oh. Oh. Greatest Northwest band of all That's time, go. RB. Uh, Are you trying to distract No! Me? <laughs> of course not. <laughs> this is so sad. Oh, Peter, gosh. If you were wondering. I'm oh, sorry. These controls are really weird. I'm just really getting lucky. Bruh. R R B R B. Okay. Uh oh. I'm being so dramatic right now. No. <laughs> uh. No, 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 no. Oh shoot! I'm clicking the wrong thing. Okay, RB. This is. This is too complicated for me, bruh. Hey! 
Oh shoot! No! <laughs> no! No! Okay, okay, okay. Hey! Hold up, no? I, I can never just move up. Freaking. Alright. Uh, um, oh, I'm losing it. I'm, I'm losing. I mean, I'm losing my focus. I can't focus no more. I won again. Woo! Shit. Oh, that's a win. I was actually trying that time. <laughs> okay, woo, wait. Let's get serious. One more game. Winner takes title of ultimate foosball champion. Should I let her win? Mm, I don't know. Come on. You know, Gabe would be all about us playing like this. Well, then Maybe I should let her win. Uh, <laughs> this is it for all the marbles. So many marbles. Definitely the kind of game you want to focus on, no matter what happens. Totally. Uh, I'm trying not to like be, like, guess obvious about it. Hey, so are you into girls? <laughs> what? Uh, sure, both. I'll date anybody, assuming they're my type. <laughs> What's your type? I'll let you know when I meet them. Oh, shoot. I mean, I ain't supposed to be losing, but, like, I ain't trying to, like, completely suck. This is what? Nope. How convinced uh, were you that that was going to work? From one to ten. <laughs> <laughs> like a three? Why are you That's distracting me so I lose? I mean, I meant to lose anyway. <laughs> <laughs> the house of Chen crumbles at last. Good game. Thank you. You're a much better loser than Gabe. That's no fun. <laughs> Sorry to spoil the victory. Oh, you're better. Did that was that really all it took? It was foosball. I thought I was gonna have to do other stuff too. It's kind of crazy that you knew exactly what would cheer me up. Don't give me too much credit. I'm the one who really needed it. Oh, I. Oh, yeah, take it. So. What are you going to do now? What do you mean? That shit with Mac. He's clearly lying, right? Uh, um, I need to learn more. I don't think he's lying. I'm not sure what Mac's deal is. His story doesn't add up. Yeah. I do know that I need to find out exactly what happened that night. For myself and for Gabe. I've got your back. No matter what. Okay. Thank you. That means a lot. I should head back to work. Cool. Bye. Bye. I know Gabe made that call, but did Mac really let the blast go off just to get back at him? No way. Maybe I should try to play this now, even though I probably suck at this too. If I suck at this, I'm cutting this out. So if you know you see a little time skip, it's because I sucked. Uh, sure. Where the heck am I? Oh. You gonna let it go down? Go <laughs> Why? Why? Why are you going so slow? What the heck? Why was it moving so slow? Oh shoot! Oh gosh! Are you serious? 
Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. I was doing it wrong. What are you doing? Bro, I'm going this way. Ah, oh, shoot. Uh Ah oh, shoot Oh, hold up now. Oh, wait a minute. Oh. They're coming after me. Oh gosh! <laughs> I hate this. Wait a minute! Oh no! Go down. Oh, no, 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 no. What the, what the heck? Are you serious? Okay, uh, I'm done. person <laughs> okay what the heck did that do what was this around here I forgot how to walk faster how do you walk faster feels like a million years since that day with Gabe hasn't even been a week how, how do I walk faster To start being productive, productive human being. Not much to toast at the moment. All right, look at that. You can't clean shoe shoe, you can clean everything else. Let's look at this. One of the happiest memories I have. Uh, Thanks, Gabe. Uh, Would have been fun to see Gabe crush some sweet powder. <laughs> or whatever snowboarders <laughs> Sweet <say>. powder. <laughs> uh... Why you look at this way? I wonder how she's really holding up. Yeah, what I want to do. Thank God for this thing. We'd never have found Ethan without it. Yeah, you're right. Kate probably would not die either. Okay, I guess 
players. The answer, my friend, is blowing in the wind. Uh-uh, stop it. Uh -uh. I don't like that buzzing now. I don't like buzz buzz. Uh, I guess he hung his clothes up to dry. What is that over there? How do, how do you walk faster? I forgot. Oh, maybe I could do this. I don't think there's anything around. Yeah, I think it would have told me. I bet Gabe could even make golf fun. So nice up here. Like, what the heck? Time to find Mac. And get some answer. This thing's been up here a while. Okay, fine. Isn't that Steph's old band? Fine, I guess I'll go talk to Mac. I want to look around. So, Why look up at the sky when you could look at a sculpture instead? I guess she's trying to rush me or something. Like, girl, I'm trying to explore. Alex, I'm having a small event for your brother and I at tomorrow at 9. I'd love to have you there, but no pressure, okay? You take all the time you need, Jed. Black lettering tavern. There's no greater meeting than a meeting over drinks. Okay. Alex, let me know if you need any groceries. Oh. I'll cover the cost. I see your alcohol is your own risk. Oh, okay. Thanks, Jed. Alex, I'm so sorry. Apartment's yours for as long as you need. You know where to find me if anything comes up. Oh, Oh my gosh, Jed. Why are there so many sweet people here? Did someone get into a fight? A tussle? I had an incredible mom. And I decided I wanted to be a ranger. She was the first person I told. She said... She said, You're exactly what these mountains need. Losing someone like that, I guess you never get used to it. Is that Jed without his beard? I can't even see their faces. Well, anyway, let's look at this chair. Things got pretty heated back there. Oh, I didn't see nobody knock over a chair. Okay. I guess I missed that. 
Oh, hey, kid, you don't have to do that. Too late. <laughs> what you mean? I'm gonna pick up a chair. Wanted to apologize. For all of us. We're all grieving, but that's no excuse. It was your brother's wake, and you both deserve better than listening to a bunch of fools squabble. Honestly, he's right. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. That was pretty rough. Although it's hard to imagine a good version of your dead brother's wake. No, mm -hmm. there's no good version. Just all of us trying to get through it together the best we can. I'm sorry, I thought I heard a, no a noise. It wasn't the first wake held in this old building. I doubt it'll be the last. What, your wife's? Anyway, if there's anything I can do, just let me know. I need to talk to Mac. I know he's lying. I just don't know why. Any idea where I can find him? Well, he helps out Eleanor at the flower Does shop. He really lie? That'd be the place to start. Thanks. I feel like I should warn you, though. You might not get the kind of closure you're looking for. If you get any at all. Just don't pin all your hopes on Mac Loudon. Oh, why did you say that? Like you. Thanks for looking out for me, but what else am I supposed to do? I wish I had an answer for you. But if you get a chance before you go all dirty, Harry, swing by the dispensary. Charlotte wants to see you. And one more thing. I've been meaning to give you this for the last few days, but I didn't want to disturb you up there. It'll get you through that door and the one upstairs. This is your home now, for as long as you'd like. Uh, what about rent? What about rent? I don't want to be a freeloader. Don't worry about that for right now. We'll work out a way for you to Earn your keep when the time comes. Wow. Thank you. Give him hell. <laughs> okay, I guess let's see Charlotte first. I... I have no idea what to even say to him. Dang, everybody want to talk to me now? Gosh dang, bruh. I guess I should read these now. Gabe was the most caring person I've ever met. He never stopped looking for ways to make life better. Whether that meant coming to Haven to find his dad or fighting to get a grill all the way up to the stairs of his rooftop. My gosh. And he was always willing to help anyone else who wanted to improve their lives. He probably put even more hours into my college interview than I did. He was the kind of person you meet once in a lifetime. Goodbye, Gabe. I'll miss you forever. Sam and George. I don't know who they are. Oh. Huh? I missed something. Oh, I can read these now. Okay. Ethan, fear. It's so easy for your brain to turn on you. The same part of you that tells stories and makes art and gives the world order and beauty and meaning is the part where nightmares grow. And sometimes those nightmares leak out, seep into the world around you. I can still see Ethan collapsing in on himself at the edge of the ravine, so scared that he couldn't move, couldn't breathe. I reached out because I had to reach out. I submitted to his fear because I couldn't think of any other way forward. And it worked. We made it back, and I collapsed on the, on the hard, solid ground. And I kept thinking, this is who you can be if you want to be. Someone who helps people. Someone who understands. For a few seconds, everything was so clear. But then the ground wasn't solid anymore, and Gabe was gone. 
what good am I to anyone if I couldn't stop that? <sighs> Girl, please. None of it will save me. Ninth Warden wouldn't be afraid. I thought I could hunt the monster. Thought I could hunt it. I thought I could be brave. Nothing can save you. There's nothing to save. Steph Sorrow. Steph's sadness was born out of love. It wasn't empty. There was dimension to it, a form and volume of loss that I could step inside. In there, I met a Gabe who felt much like my own, only more so. And that's together, a listener, a prodder, a cheerleader, a shit stirrer, a brother, basically. It wasn't long, but it was enough to know exactly what stuff needed. The best piece of my brother I could conjure for her from thin air for just a moment. So we played foosball. And for once, Steph got to win. It was a dumb and goofy over in a flash, but in the wake, the sadness was lifted, and Gabe didn't seem quite as gone as before. First Ethan, now Steph. I think I'm finally starting to understand this thing. Gabe was right. It was a gift to connect to someone. Aw. To feel what they are feeling. To help them. Just wish he'd been around to tell me earlier. Foosball champion. Don't shit on my yard. I'll be crashing here tonight. Move to Denver. One more time, okay? I want to make things right, so I'll be crashing here tonight. Don't turn off the lights. Okay. So did I complete Gabe's memories, but... Bring something that reminds you of him. Oh, gosh. Oh. Oh, what the heck? Dang, bro. <laughs> I'm so done. Charlotte said I'm proud of you. <laughs> okay, let me... Oh, wait. Okay. Ducky. <laughs> wow. <sighs> Dang. Okay, wait, let me read all this. So, okay. All right, then. she wasn't very fond of this doctor, huh? Dang, I got something else. A year ago, I was ready to ditch this place to keep moving, like I always do. And a year ago, Gabe was the reason I stayed. But even though he's gone now, and even though I miss him like hell, I still have reasons to stay. 
Thanks for showing me that, Alex. Oh. <laughs> what? What the heck? You had to say, Mac. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> I should put something here. It's the least I can do. Wonder what I can find up here to add to Gabe's memory table. <laughs> That would be funny, but uh, I can't click on that. <laughs> Definitely not a freaking bro. I could add this to Gabe's table. Do I even know what that is? I wonder how she's really holding up. Maybe I should put this downstairs. Yeah, I think so. You're coming downstairs. Yeah, that's the one. Cause I'm like, do I even know what that freaking album is, bro? I don't know. Or maybe it's the King of Lions one thing. But eh, that doesn't have that much nostalgia, even though it was a good moment, you know. Unless she can put multiple things. If she can put multiple things, then I'll take it, I guess. This is perfect for the memory table. Yeah, I guess I'll, I think that's better, probably. I never got to see bartender Gabe in action, but he left some pretty big shoes to fill. something to add to Gabe's table. That's not the table, that's food. It's more like it. Remote. Damn, Ducky. <laughs> I like how it says everyone else. What the heck? I'll spend the rest of my life wondering what would have happened if Ryan hadn't cut that rope. I bet he will too. Jeez. Why do I feel like this is a challenge?
Okay. Look, I appreciate what you're trying to do for me, Mr. Lucan, but I'm not staying long. And I don't take handouts. Just maybe don't cash that check like right now. Jed, thanks for being there when Gabe needed you. No one could blame me for wanting to drink all my sorrows away. No one could blame me for wanting to drink all my sorrows away. R.M. and T.B. I wonder who they were. I wonder what Gabe's favorite track on here was. Okay, Jed said I might find Mac in the flower shop, but I have time to swing by the dispensary if I want. The visit to the dispensary, record store. I don't remember where these things are at all. Let's. Pike's really had his work cut out for him these last few days. Hey, Pike. Hey! Um, how you holding up? No. I've been better. Guess I've been better. Yeah, right. <laughs> Dumb <laughs> question. Hey, I want you to know I meant what I said back there. Gabe was something else. He could bring a smile to my face even on the worst days. Yeah. That's what everyone's been saying. That's a good thing. And, uh... When you're ready, I still need to get your statement for the investigation. Yeah. I think I'll be ready soon. Yeah. Yeah. No rush. Why does it look all weird? What's this? What's this building? That's the... <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> oh wait. Wildflowers. Insert epiphany about new D beginnings here. Just walk. No, I can't. Why can't I walk over things, huh? Why not? It's bullshit. We have a right to know what's happening to our jobs. Oh. You guys don't think anything's really gonna change, right? It's hard to say. Yeah, because they won't tell us a damn thing. I just still can't wrap my head around it. Someone died? It's a shit situation. But the least they could do is be upfront with us about our job security. Exactly. I just hope the council passes the vote. Oh, this is pretty serious. So, huh? anyone seen Loudon? I mean, of course it was Not serious, but I mean, like, for night. their jobs. Poor son of a bitch. <laughs> we should get him a beer sometime. in eight years of my life and they can't give me back one simple answer about my job Typhon doesn't give a shit about anyone this location gets all the foot traffic and word around the water cooler is the mining company 
is about to expand. More jobs means more customers for you. What about that oh. accident? Frankly, I'm a little spooked. If Typhon goes under, I'd lose all my business. It's very unlikely that anything with Typhon will change. They've been the largest employer in Haven for decades. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I'm sold. Glad to hear it. I'll draw up the contract and call you tomorrow to talk next steps. Oh, customers here are a lot nicer than in Denver. Never been to Denver, but I guarantee they're nice here. Might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Jed said Charlotte okay, wants to talk to me. I... Wanna do something together next week? I don't remember what it was. Sure. I have a pottery class Wednesday night. No, I don't Gotta know. Join. Wait. Oh. <laughs> I was sure I was about I to pass it. Grab a bite with... Oh, sorry. We met briefly. You're Gabe Chen's sister, right? Alex, yeah. I didn't know him well, but I could tell he had a big heart. I'm so sorry for your loss. Okay. Charlotte? Alex, hey. Jed said you wanted to see me? I just wanted to see how you were doing. Oh. I'm... staying busy? <laughs> I've been trying to stay busy, mostly. Yeah. Distractions help. How about you? I can't even imagine what you're going through. Honestly, I'm really trying to keep it together for Ethan. He's hurting. Yeah. I hear he's been having a rough time. Yeah, I know he is. He practically just lost a father. Yeah. But he's shutting me out. He's never done that before. Not when it mattered. He just needs time. Everyone grieves differently. Maybe he just needs some time. We've been through a lot together. With the divorce and moving. He's never shut down like this. I just can't get through to him. I can't get over the feeling that the one person who could help me deal with the aftermath of Gabe's death... ...is Gabe. <sighs> what is this? An affidavit from Typhon. If I sign, I'm agreeing not to press charges in exchange for a payment. A big one. Oh. Uh, that's shady. That's so shady. Why would they be offering you money if they didn't do anything wrong? They say it's an offer of good faith, but you're right. He's dead because of them, and I'd be letting them off. Are you gonna sign it? I don't know. I'm trying to put Ethan first, but... What would you do? Do you... Think it would be a betrayal of Gabe? Oh gosh. I 
I don't think it would be a betrayal, but I do think it would be in bad taste. Like, it's just, I don't know, just win your money in court or something. I, yeah, turn, turn the offer down. You just can't, bro. It just turn it down. I don't think you should sign it. I'm sorry. I know it's hard, but you can't let Typhon buy you off. Gabe made that call, and I'm going to prove it. I just, I need some time. Did he really make that? Like, I don't think I remember seeing him make that Thanks call. for being honest. I'm not going to judge you now, but like. If they're willing to pay Charlotte to keep quiet, they're definitely hiding something. I really appreciate Of course, she's right. But I could really use that money. We can't give in, no matter how hard yeah. it is. Glass pipes are so cool. They're like works of art that can also Girl. get you high. I'm gonna figure out why Max lied. Okay, so if he is lying, then why would he lie about it? Sweet logo. Bet Charlotte designed it herself. I really love Charlotte's style. Yeah, it's like that silhouette type thing. <laughs> really? Um, that was weird. That's a Zemi. In the Dominican, they're said to house the spirits of gods. Mostly, I just like how huh. it looks. It's okay. really cool. So you're Dominican. Is there anything else around here? It's okay if I go back here? Well, she ain't say nothing, so it must be... Man, these things better do the trick. I'm averaging like three hours a night. Pro tip, insomnia doesn't usually come from nowhere and THC is way better at treating it when you're also tackling the underlying cause. Mm -hmm. Any idea what's keeping you up? And Teresa? These bougie dispensaries are gonna put all the creepy dudes named Gene out of business. I hope these helped a little, Gabe. Huh. There's nothing quite like a cup of weed <laughs> on a cold day. Charlotte's dedication to her art is so inspiring. Marijuana tea. And which part of the brain is responsible for the crazy glowy feelies? <laughs> okay, I guess I should leave now. Oh wait, there's a, there's a list. When did you start needing a PhD to smoke pot? Well... Stairway to Haven? <laughs> believe it or not, Gabe Of course he one. did. <laughs> oh, I believe it. It blows my mind that Charlotte's been running the dispensary this whole time. I couldn't even leave the apartment. I know you need that money, Charlotte, but bro. Uh, I could totally paint that. I just don't want to. <laughs> okay. These are my kind of discounts. A little steep, but can you really put a price <laughs> on a kid's dreams? Nice contribution, Gabe. I'm always here for you, if you need anything. Thanks. Back at you. And he did it all with one rusty saw and a bottle of gin. Impressive. <laughs>
Okay, we're leaving now. Now I guess we're going to see stuff. Still need to check the flower shop for Mac. Okay, but still. Warning. Yeah, a warning would have been nice. It's fine. I love being on hold. I love this song. <laughs> Finally, cancel AAA membership. No, I, I said cancel. Ooh. Yikes. <laughs> Oh, okay. Steph asked me to pop by the record store if I had time. Yes, because I don't know what this Mac thing, how long that's going to last, or if it leads to like the, the next cutscene or something. And then I can't go back here, so I'm going now. Steph asked me to swing by. She's got to be around here somewhere. How could Chrissy leave me after everything we've okay. been through together? It's hard to beat breakup music, but maybe I can find something around here to cheer him oh. up. Ninth Warden's cool, but not as cool as Thanor. The breakup section, huh? That's rough, <laughs> buddy. Do you really want me to find something? Wait, Chrissy? She's a dog? Dialogue on that. Hey, you posted about a lost dog, right? I think they have her over at Todd's Hardware. Are you serious? Uh, thank you so much. I I'll call them right now. Okay. Hi, I'm calling about the lost dog. Chrissy? Is she helpful? <laughs> okay. Oh, thank Looks God. Looks like Steph might be working on a new project. Oh, awesome. Yes. Thank you so much. Can I pick her up today? No sweat. Take your time. I'll wait. Maybe I'll get to hear her play sometime. Still going. You just still sit on the phone, sir. I can't believe he ordered that record. Fuck. I'm glad Gabe convinced her to stay. Hey, I'm glad you stopped by. I've only got a sec, but... Have you talked to Ethan at all? Mm -hmm. He's taking it really hard. But what you did for me this morning got me thinking. What if Ethan needs something like that too? Something fun and distracting. Something like <laughs> oh, gosh. Like the one you and Gabe were going to take him to? Yeah, but designed just for him all and Thanor. Right. Honestly, that's a good idea. He'll love that. Yeah, I'm glad you think so. I need your help, though. I want it to be as good as it can be. 
Ethan gave you one of his uh, comics, right? So, what do you think? Who would the famous monster slayer have the most fun defeating? Uh, I don't know, bro. Storm Richter? Uh. Storm Rider looks like a worthy I, opponent. I hope he, he isn't bored. <laughs> All right then. Oh, I gotta get back in there. There's some stuff in my comp book. Be cool if you could check it out. Oh Help gosh. me make some calls. I'll see what I can do. I do not remember all the stuff that's in that comic book, bro. Hey, uh, Haven listeners, that was Phone Tap with their new single, Elephant in the Room. We've got a sweet block of English oh, there it goes. down the pike. Wow, First, really? Well, that's just okay. That's not the one I had. The spring festival is just around the corner. Spon oh. Looks like Steph wants me to do more than just make some decisions. She wants me to play a bard. Uh. Guess I'm in. Let's start with my name. Hell, bring your ex. I'm sure it'll be different oh. this time. Uh. That sounds cool. How about a throwback to Ethan's old buddy? Ability time. Distortion field sounds fun, but healing serenade could really come in handy. Uh, distortion. Let's go with distortion field. How did I meet Thanor? Heroic story. It was a dark and stormy night. This LARP thing just might work. You're just gonna sit there on the phone. Just holding it. He should be leaving. Where the heck is this cat at? I guess it's on the ground somewhere. It just keeps me out, huh? I have no idea where it is, but I kinda don't care, so... What am I supposed to do now? Knock knock? It's sweet. She's planning a whole LARP for Ethan. Or do Ethan. I just leave? Do I just leave? I guess so. Thanks again. Me and Chrissy owe you one. You bet. I'm just trying to make sure I ain't like down here or something. Oh, there you are. Val, I just want to be friends. Okay, yeah, it's time to go, I guess. Still need to check the flower shop for Mac. Flower shop. Wherever that is. Where is the flower shop? Is it over? Where is that for? Oh, it's that guy's sister. I've 
feel so bad for her. Getting sick of people feeling bad for me. <laughs> oh, oh gosh. <laughs> she was right here. Is it? No, it's not. Okay. I was wrong. Oh, okay. Just the wrong door. Or maybe it was just the wrong building entirely. Eleanor? Oh, I mean, you didn't say anything. All you did sorry. was wait. <laughs> no need to apologize. How are you, dear? <laughs> oh. I'm, um... Adjusting. Still just trying to adjust, I think. Give yourself some time. Change is always hard. Um. Uh, is Mac here? Oh, he was helping me not too long ago. I think he just left. Can't have gotten too far. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Thanks. Now, what was I? Oh? Hmm. Are you... You freaking out because you forgot what you were doing? She looks terrified. I can't oh, leave her like can't. this. My gosh, what's, what's your problem? Oh shoot, I missed it. What the? Why it went away? Oh, okay, it just, uh, I'm just dumb. I kept clicking a button like it wasn't already right there. Okay, yeah, I she feel forgot what she was doing. Broken. The doctor said I had more time, but everything is becoming so out of order. Honestly, I guess it is kind of terrifying. Your memories are pretty much part of your identity, you no? Know? Or they make up your identity. If they know, if they about, know my about my condition, they'll make me close this place. Close this place. Wait a minute. That's not just some, like, forgetting stuff type thing. That was even... Pretty incorrect. Do I go back here? Oh, okay. I didn't know I could go all the way back here. If Riley finds out, she can't. Why can't she find out? out? Like things are blending together and not making sense. It 
it's not just that she forgot what she was doing. She's afraid she's forgetting everything. But how can yeah. I help her? I'm just like, is this how dementia is like? It seems like it's a little bit more than that, but I don't know. What the? What is that? Oh, it's just a light. Can I help you now? Forget what you were working on? <sighs> you could say I'm having a bit of a senior moment. <laughs> well, maybe I can help. Uh, focus on something uh, else? You could focus on something else for a bit and see if it comes back. I suppose. But I can't help feeling like it was something important. Whatever it was. Okay, that wasn't it. X Riley? Does Riley know? You could ask her. Oh, no, no. Okay, yeah, that's cool. I didn't think that was it. I wouldn't want to bother her. Retrace your steps. Seems like you have a lot going on today. I could help you retrace your steps. Oh, I, I don't want to keep you. <laughs> hey. I... I want to help. Oh. Okay, so that was it. Not first try. Okay. What would Eleanor have done oh, first? Oh gosh. What would she have done first? Uh, the door. You must have flipped the sign to open. I always flip it first thing when I come in. And then I open my mail. Something must have distracted me. Better. We can do this. So you opened your mail. Where the heck is your mail at? Is it in the air? Why are you doing that? You're freaking me out. Okay. Uh. This? Was this second? Okay, maybe this. Did you trim these flowers today? Maybe that wasn't it. I. Don't remember. That wasn't it. Uh. What? You were over here when I came in. Maybe you were counting the drawer. You don't have to do this. I'll be all right on my that own. That wasn't it. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. Okay, that wasn't it. Gosh, hey. Uh, second. Could a phone call have distracted you? Yes. I got a call first thing in the morning. But I can't think who it was. Maybe we can find something to remind you. Uh. Could it have been Riley who called? I think that's right. She called 
to tell me about a new order. <sighs> Goodness. What was the order for? Gosh, hey. Okay, what was it for? Uh, flowers? Rush order. This must be what Riley came in for. I think that order might have been for these lilies. Of course. Riley helped me pick them out before she left. Now we just have to figure out who ordered them. How the heck ordered them? The check for the lilies would be in here, right? That could tell us who bought them. It should. Mr. Jedediah Lucan. Huh. Interesting. Looks like the lilies are for Jed. That's right. Riley dropped off an order for Jed. I knew you'd figure it out. I couldn't have done it without you. Jed must be hosting some event. I wonder why he wants lilies, though. They're traditionally for funerals. God. She doesn't oh. remember. That's why she just easily acts with shoes. Bear her to pay. Uh, no, I'm telling her about Gabe. Like, why wouldn't I tell her? Yeah, I'm telling her. They were. They were for Gabe's wake. Gabe's wake? Gabe's wake? I oh, I didn't even think about it. that. But I mean, she would have found out later. It's Alex. okay. You. I'm. I'm oh, so God. sorry. Hey, it's um... Excuse me. Oh gosh. <laughs> I feel like that was the right thing to do. Like, whether that spared her feelings, obviously, that, I mean, uh. Okay. That sucked. But at least I told yeah, her the truth. Yeah, because I, I just, that, that seemed like the right thing to do. She's really hurting. But I didn't oh, want to lie to her. That poor young man. <laughs> How did I forget? Oh. I'm so sorry, Eleanor. I, I just could not say nothing about that, bro. That's messed up. I mean, like, she just would have found out later. And she was like, oh my gosh, Alex was being so nice to me. It didn't say anything. Eleanor said Mac is nearby. I don't see him here. Maybe at the bridge? bridge. Anyone has any good- Oh, sure cats. That's a strange looking cat. Yeah, okay, he got, like... That didn't look like no cat, bro. Oh, so I think I could just left and not do anything with it. That'd be kind of messed up. These people are upset. I don't get it. Do people just not want ice cream anymore? 
I looked over the budget. If we only open three days a week, we'll be able yeah. to scrape by. Is that it? I have to keep up a brave face for Angela. She loves our store so much. He must be exhausted. Things will get better. Pirate Peaches is making an actual profit, remember? You're losing our business. But it's like everything's a joke to him. She must feel so alone. Hope they figure it out. We should push the rum oh. raisin harder. It's surprisingly addictive. It's the fresh. It's you. sweet. Am I going the wrong way? How's your progress? I, uh... your chicken coop? No, I could I have no <laughs> idea. Uh, okay. I'm guessing this way? This is the way? Huh? Oh, this is the bridge. I, I was tripping. There you are, Mackie boy. I'm so fucked. Can't hide from me forever. Why? What Mac? happened, huh? So Time you were lying about not getting the call. So what happened? Mac. Alex. I don't Look, care. It's not a good time. You owe me an explanation about what happened to Gabe. What? Costing me my hey, girlfriend hey, sure. wasn't enough for you? You cost yourself your own now girlfriend. You're gonna accuse me of killing Gabe too? I said I need an explanation. I get it. He died on your shift and you're freaked. But you have to come clean. Please. There's nothing what, I can tell you. Is the company trying to shut you up? Mac, is that it? Come on. He was my big brother. I can't. Something definitely has him scared. Maybe if I could tap into his fear, I could get to the truth. I wonder if I can not get the truth out of her. I just need to find something I could use to push, push him over, over the, the edge. edge. Why do you want to do that? Everyone's out to get me. Alex, Ryan, even Riley. Fuck! Even Riley? Did something happen with her? What am I supposed to do? Get Riley? <laughs> <laughs> what am I supposed to do? Here, we'll literally try to push them all. What the heck am I supposed to be doing? <laughs> push him over the edge. So am I supposed to listen to people talk? Let's see. Sorry about today. It's not your fault. Why should one accident close all the trails? What a wasted vacation. Yes. We're all suffering here. I think the trails will be closed for a while. I don't need to listen to this conversation again. Man, these overnight shifts really take it out of me. Yeah, my sleep schedule's fucked. Coffee in the morning, whiskey before bed. Works like a charm. Talk about the accident? How would I know that? Fuck, now I'm on Diane's Diane. Diane. Thanks, Diane. Yep, the park looks fun to explore. When he was little, this whole thing is so horrible. Did you see him over by the water? Yeah, he looked rough. I didn't talk to him. I wasn't really sure what to say. There's literally nothing I can do for Ethan. I feel so useless. I've been there. Where are you 
hiding my feathered f Oh, sorry. Uh -huh. You're fine. What? Cool binoculars. You bird watching? <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to win a contest. Oh, good luck. Thanks. Okay. I keep accidentally clicking that. <laughs> You're writing a novel? Since when? I just started. I have no idea uh -huh. what I'm doing. Babe, this is great. What if I die tomorrow? Dang. Just like that guy. What have I Dang. done with my life? I don't have any easy answers for that. What's the rush? I guess. Like, I, what am I supposed to be doing? I wonder how many fish Ducky's caught in this thing. Like, I'm just, I'm just supposed to enjoy the scenery? Is that what? Just enjoying the scenery. Do I even want to stay here without Gabe? In this state I've never been to before. This town I've been in for less than a week. Not that I know where else I'd even go. Back to the nothing waiting for me in Portland. Fuck. I have no idea what comes next. But I'm not leaving here without answers about Gabe. At least I know that. I wonder if I am dreaming. Everything feels so strange now. Under okay, this yeah, I like this song. Sky. I wonder if there's still meaning in all the things I'm feeling. Should I say? accident was it on the news no no one's been fired yet yes mom I, I still have a job at Typhoon they still have plans to expand okay Riley well, where the heck is Riley? That's why I thought I had talked to Riley, but I have no idea where she is. Like, where would I even find her? I just need to find something I could use to push him over the edge. Riley, of course, but where the heck is Riley? Where is she? I have no idea. <laughs> where? Oh, where, oh, where could Riley be? Oh, where, oh, where could she be? I'm assuming she's not going to be anywhere I've already been in. Jeez, it's getting bad out there, ain't it? Tragically, now isn't the time to check out the rest of Haven. Okay, maybe she's here somewhere. That oh. might be our feathered friend. Cool binoculars. You bird watching? <laughs> yeah.
Yeah, I'm trying to win a contest. Oh. No. Good luck. Thanks. <laughs> of course, chairs would be in the way, so I can't walk up the freaking stairs. I, I am just. This is taking probably entirely way too long. This is cool. In a wicker man sort of way. Ethan? He looks so alone. Hey, buddy. Hey, Alex. Do you want to talk about it? I'm fine. Uh-uh. You ain't had to give me an attitude. Okay. Definitely not fine. Where are we? Everyone needs to stop telling me it's okay. It's not. Fuck. Losing Gabe's been hard enough for a supposed grown-up like me. But for Ethan... I'm here for you, whenever you need me. That's a new dialogue option. Hey. I just saw Ethan. He's a pretty insightful kid. He knows how much you're hurting even when you try to hide it from him. Instead of trying to be strong, maybe the best thing you can do is show him that it's okay to hurt. That's really helpful, Alex. Thank you. Huh. I'm sorry, Ethan. I can do better. I hope Ethan opens up. Charlotte would do anything for him. I'm always here for you, if you need anything. I swear, she's someone back here. Uh, oh my gosh. She was back here the whole time. Hey, Riley. Alex. Hey. <sighs> She's taken care of me ever since I was little. I never really knew my mom, but she's always been there for me. What does she think about you going away to school? She's thrilled. <laughs> I think she just wants me to end up happy. That's really sweet. She's the most selfless person I know. I know having you work with her in the shop has meant the world. Yeah. To both of us. I know you and Gabe were close. How are you doing? I miss him so much. like an older brother to me. I'm glad you had him. He was a really good guy, Alex. That fight Mac had with Gabe over your secret meetings. 
They were about you applying to college, right? Yeah. Ever since the first time Mac lost his shit in front of them, Gabe and Charlotte had tried to get me to end things with him. And after all this, I can see that they were right. Do you think he's telling the truth about the call? That Gabe never made it? No, I... I it's not that... I... Sorry. Uh, I'm really not ready to talk about it. The extra question? Uh, talking might help? Are you sure? Sometimes talking about it can help you sort it all out. I'm just not there yet. Oh, gosh, come on, girl. Really? What am I supposed to do now? I gotta run. <laughs> There's some stuff I need to do. Okay. I don't want to push Riley, but I need to know more about Mac. How do I get her to open up? <laughs> How do I get her to talk about it? Come on, what the heck? Okay, I'm not going far. What could be back there? Open. Damn. Maybe there's something around here I can use to get it open. I'm doing way more than I thought I was going to be doing this episode. Okay. <laughs> I've broken into places for less. I cannot stress this enough. Pa. So it's just nothing back here. Okay. That was nice. Real nice. Are you gonna close it back? You're just gonna leave it open? Alright then. Somehow, even after everything, I never had to live on the street. I hope this person's all right. Simple but effective. <sighs> Guess they didn't feel like painting the mine. If I tell them I like him, we'll date, and then we'll break up, and then I'll lose my best friend. I mean, you don't know that. Come on, man. Can't you take a hint? She's not into you. Let it go. Hmm. Maybe I could help them. Wait, hell no. <laughs> what am I thinking? <laughs> This is none of my business. <laughs> now what the heck am I supposed to do now? I might be too close to the issue to have an unbiased opinion, but fuck this. Ok, 
cannot talk to Mac. We can't talk to Riley either. I don't know, maybe we can try her again. Thanks for spending time with me. Thanks for letting me. Maybe Riley knows something I can use against Mac. If he's innocent, why is he acting like this? Acting like what? Okay. <laughs> Maybe I can get her to tell me. <laughs> I'm overthinking this so badly. Okay. Oh, Do okay. Want to talk about Mac? Yeah, I get it. It's just, if he didn't do anything wrong, why is he acting like he has something to hide? He asked me to leave Haven with him. What? What? Right after the wake. Uh. He wouldn't tell me why. But he just looked so guilty. Oh my gosh. I told him no. And that we were done. And now... What if they were still together? I'm scared. He did something horrible. Riley. Thank you for telling me. You deserve the truth. I gotta run. What the heck the heat? There's some stuff I need to do. Um, okay. I really didn't think he, I really just thought he didn't do anything, but did he do something? Look. We'll talk soon? Yeah. Yeah. Whenever you want. Mac trying to skip town is sketchy as shit. I don't know why I went this way. I bet I could use that to stoke his fear. I know what this means. Somewhere. There's a dog I need to pet. <laughs> okay. That's... What the heck is going on with this company? Like... I'm sorry, I keep moving the camera so much. I should make sure there's nothing else I want to do before I confront Mac. Okay, uh, Oh, okay, so the game tells you anyway. That's funny. Well, I already did everything else, I'm pretty sure, so... This must be like the end of so. What Riley told me might do it, but I should make sure there isn't anything I still want to do around town first. <laughs> Give you another chance, but I already did it. I'm pretty sure I already did everything. Okay, let's do this. Your ex girlfriend told me about your plans oh, to the way he skip looked. town. That's not something innocent people do. <laughs> Why are you gonna talk to him like that? Oh God, it's not. I didn't do anything. And why are you trying to skip town? Oh. Fuck off. Hey, hey. Leave me alone. Where are you going, dude? Uh, um Oh, he feels like everyone's watching him, huh? That's why he wants to leave. He's paranoid. This is so cool what they're doing with this, though. Fuck. I'll deal with Mac when I get to him. For now, I need to learn everything I can. Typhon's always watching. They run this whole town. Huh? Feels like everyone's staring at him. Yeah, clearly. Everyone thinks I killed him. They all hate me. 
Wow, is that, that's not what it said. I should have read it. That's definitely not what that newspaper said. It's not fair. It's not I didn't do anything wrong. It should have been you instead. Oh. Alex? Dang, that's how you feel, bro? Oh my gosh. No. What the hell? There are people out there. No, I told you to call it off. So they didn't listen to him? Is that what happened? But why did he lie about not getting I the call? The they looked at me at the wake. They all think I let him die. Okay, now I feel kind of bad for him. He clearly has some issues. You need therapy, I sir. I know why you're lying. Typhon's forcing you to deny the call. What the fuck? I know you tried to stop it. They fucked up, not you. Stop lying for them! You don't get it. This wasn't some accident. I told them you were down there, and they detonated anyway. On purpose? Why? I don't know. I swear. And then I get a message telling me to deny there was ever Who were they trying to kill? You gotta believe me. Cave and I, we didn't get along. That's I, I didn't creepy. want him dead. Messed up. And now, now Typhon's watching me. My girlfriend. She, she's not your she girlfriend I'm a anymore. My neighbors all hate me. I mean, oh. What, what the fuck am I supposed well, to maybe do? Maybe you need to get out here. I think I can calm him down, but does he deserve it? Yes, because he tried. He didn't want the man dead. Yes, I'm calming him down. <laughs> All right, Mac. Come on. You gotta calm down, okay? Dude, stay with me. I know what it's like to be doubted. To have everyone think the worst of you. Mm -hmm. But the truth will come out. I'll make sure of it. But Typhon... If Typhon comes after you, they're gonna have to get through me too, okay? Okay. Okay. Thanks. I actually feel a little better. Good. <laughs> Yeah, well, you learn a thing or two hanging out with shrinks your whole life. <laughs> <laughs> so, what are you gonna do now? I'll oh, find out what happened. Well, why it happened. Don't leave Haven. I'm gonna get to the truth. Like, really, what is going, what conspiracy is going on here? They couldn't have been trying to kill Gabe. I don't think so, at least. Were they trying to kill Ryan? And maybe they just didn't care if anyone else got, anyone else got caught up in it? Hey. Yeah, it's... Can we talk? Where are you? Okay. Um. 
Oh, okay. You were right. About Typhon, about Mac. Alex. Mac got the call. How do you know that? He got the call and he lied about it. Doesn't matter. Someone is putting pressure on him to keep quiet. Someone from the mine and... It doesn't matter! Why not? I keep coming here and playing it back. But it always ends the same. Ryan. He's dead. He's really dead, Alex. <sighs> she really be reaching her hand out like that now. Oh my gosh. She just be reaching her hand out like this and no one pays it no attention. Okay, well this one's a little bit more like normal. Oh. All the time she just reached her hand out. It's kind of a weird thing to do, you know. No one pays no attention. Though. Wow. It was my fault. My job is to keep people safe, and I failed. What could you have done about that, though? Ryan, I owe you my life. She's wrong. I let her cross that log. I put Gabe in harm's way. Uh, no one hero. else could have crossed it but me. A coward. Worse than worthless. You've got to stop torturing yourself. You did everything you could have. It doesn't matter. Gabe's dead because of me. Gabe, I'm so sorry. Oh, what are you doing, sir? Sir? <laughs> well, a little too close to the edge. Forgive yourself, bro. There's only one person holding you responsible for this, Ryan. You need to forgive yourself. <laughs> You're not alone. gorilla suit <laughs> does he also jump off of the cliff and into the pool no no he chases a guy in a banana suit <laughs> that guy jumps off the cliff and into the pool okay i'm i'm sorry this is a mexican restaurant eh, nominally <laughs> <laughs> the food is uh well, terrible but it's gabe's favorite place <laughs> i tell you he's the oldest 12 year old i know you something? Of course. You came up here to tell me that I was right about Mac. About him getting the call. How did you know? There's something you should know about me. And it's gonna be easier to show you than to explain oh, it. Oh, you're gonna tell him? I ain't even got the choice, so okay. It's cool again. 
This is gonna seem sort of weird at first, then really weird. Do you trust me? Uh, think of something scary? Yeah, why not? Okay. Think of something that just scares the shit out of you. Really focus until you feel it. Mac, Typhon, all of it. You're afraid you won't know how to handle it without Gabe. Never knew anyone so good at getting into and out of trouble. <laughs> Why is he so bored? Oh, man, this one time. <laughs> Whatever it is you're thinking about right now, don't stop, okay? Keep going. Okay. <laughs> hey, why is he so pretty? I don't understand. <laughs> like, what emotion like, is Like, I'll just really look at him. I'm just like, he, he looks pretty pretty. It's pretty. I was about to say pretty pretty. <laughs> Well, this is happiness. <laughs> e euphoria? <laughs> so you don't only feel negative emotions. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's nice for her. Must be a good memory. I wonder if I can piece it together. Gabe, Goose. I see it. It'll move. It's not moving. <laughs> It'll move. <laughs> Gabe! What the heck? Oh. That's interesting. Let's let it drive it. Ugh. That's a lot he of killed a goose! Gabe, this is serious. <laughs> Killing a Canadian goose is a violation of international law. Bruh. Shut up. <laughs> it is not. They're Canadian geese, Gabe. Property of the crown. The the crown of... Property of the crown, Gabe. The crown. What do we do? <laughs> is he gonna pray for the goose now? I'm like you're trying to cover up a murder. How deep you think? Deeper than that. The Royal Canadian Mounted Police can spot a goose grave at a hundred paces. Oh my gosh. The Mounties? <laughs> oh, come on, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. How long were you going to let me dig? <laughs> I wasn't going to stop you. <laughs> oh my gosh. So, <laughs> did you finish burying the goose or uh, not? I guess whatever makes you <laughs> okay, laugh. So I don't see what's so funny about killing a crowd. goose and him trying to <laughs> cover up his murder. But all right. well, they are technically protected under the Migratory Bird Treaty Act. <laughs> <laughs> How? I got. Powers. So, 
I guess I have this power. I can see other people's emotions. They show up like an aura, and if I get too close, I, I feel what they feel, as if I was feeling it myself. And when I focus, I can even understand why they're feeling it. And that's what you just did with... with me? Whew. Some kind of power. No kidding. It's... it's only ever been the bad emotions before. That, that was pure joy. Who else knows? Gabe did. But now I guess just you. And that's how I know Max terrified of Typhon. He reported Gabe's call, and they ignored it. Now they're putting pressure on him to toe the line. Okay, but... why? I don't know yet. Someone made the decision to let the blast go off. Okay, maybe it wasn't necessarily Seems the pressure like trying to kill people. Who would be a good maybe start. they just didn't care, and it's just like, we're just gonna let them go off so anyway. you're going after Typhon? You'll need help. You don't have to. <sighs> You're stuck with me now. Well, why not hug him? Hug him. Oh, that was a... Okay. Cool. <laughs> You're... Welcome, I guess. Thanks. Thank you. No. Thank you. This one's for you, Gabe. I miss you. speak this morning. I couldn't. Hearing everyone talk about him, about the life he had here with all of you, I lost the chance to have that. But even though I only had one day with him, he changed my life. said, I didn't know if I belonged here. He told me that home isn't something you find. It's something you build. I 
love you, Gabe. Calm down Mac from his panic attack. Reminded him of what happened. Okay, seems like I'm in a majority. Hold on. Oh, so she's sciencey if you don't visit her. Interesting. Oh, I didn't even see that. Are you serious? Dang, why a lot of people didn't add nothing to the table? Oh. Oh, I think maybe I was thinking about sitting down, but I guess I just didn't. Yeah, I, I could not admit that I didn't hear the call in front of everybody like that. That'd be kind of messed up, honestly. But we know for sure that he called, so... The little white lie was okay. Wow, why was I twenty percent? Okay. Everybody hugged him just about. Oh, I didn't know how to help her, my bad. <laughs> Sad dude. Okay. Well that's it.